The PSP had three Grand Theft Auto games. Two were full 3D games that were impressive replicas of the PlayStation 2 Grand Theft Auto experience, and the third was Grand Theft Auto Chinatown Wars. This was a top-down GTA game in the vein of the original GTA game. You play as Huang Li, the son of a murdered triad boss that arrives in America to work for his criminal uncle. Along the way, you take on a variety of missions and work as a drug dealer as you expand your personal empire and track down the man that stole your father's sword and family heirloom. I really love this game. I played it on the DS and then bought it again for my PSP. It took the Grand Theft Auto experience and style and condensed it perfectly to a top-down retro action game. Similar to other Grand Theft Auto games, you accept missions from non-playable characters. The missions were short and perfect for a handheld, with lots of variety from straightforward attack and kill missions, to races, to evading the police. Even outside of the core game, you could get lost in dealing drugs. You buy drugs from one dealer and sell it to another for a profit. I found it quite addictive just driving around buying and selling drugs and seeing my money pile up. There was a variety of cars to steal, and the differences in speed and handling was noticeable. Like in the 3D GTA games, you could just get lost in driving around the city finding random hidden missions or just getting into chases with the police. The game was just fun. It was also really funny with the main character making random jokes and innuendos. The comic style cutscenes were never boring. The soundtrack was excellent and the in-game radio gave you a lot of choice of what you want to listen to. A common complaint I have with all PSP games is the graphics when you play them on a Vita. GTA Chinatown Wars looks blocky but overall it's aged much better than some other 3D games. The driving feels smooth and fast, but when you're out of the car, the walking and running feels a bit stiff. It's not a big deal, although when you jump out of a flaming car while being chased by the police and your only option is to run on foot, you do wish for smoother movement. Overall, this is a great game that still holds up today. If you enjoy GTA games or have fond memories for the original GTA, then you should definitely pick this up. The gameplay is fun, the story is interesting, and it's perfect for playing in short bursts. I sunk so many hours into this game on my PSP and DS, and still find it fun to play today. That's why Grand Theft Auto Chinatown Wars is my retro recommendation. So, have you played Grand Theft Auto Chinatown Wars, and what did you think of it? Leave a comment, and as always, thanks for watching.